Sage Steele, Jay Harris back on Sports Center, and today is Decision Day for one of the nation's best high school junior quarterbacks, Jaden Davis of Charlotte Providence Day in North Carolina. Threw for 3,400 yards and 43 touchdowns and leading his school to a 12 and 1 record in the state title. And he was named Mr. Football in North Carolina. He's narrowed his choices to Tennessee, Michigan, Ohio State, Clemson, and of course, the University of North Carolina. And we are joined now by Jaden Davis and, and his fam, all the folks around him, sixth ranked QB in the ESPN 300 for 2024. Jaden, what has this decision process been like for you and your family? No, this decision process has been a whirlwind. You know, me being uh, received my first offer at the age of 13, now being 17, and you know, ready to make my college decision. It's been nothing short of a blessing. Uh, stressful at times, um, but as you see, the, the people you know behind me and behind the screen, um, it's been nothing short of a blessing. I appreciate all the support, um, whether it comes from my family, friends, or you know, fans across the world. So uh, this process has been nothing but a blessing. Um, we're kind of ready to get over with as well. So. Okay, before we let you do that, what, what are your emotions like right now? Uh, I'm not a guy that really gets nervous, but I'm, I'm a little nervous. Uh, there's a couple million people watching right now, so uh, shout out to everybody that's tuning in. Um, but yeah, just uh, just going just gonna to speak from the heart, and whatever the good man upstairs tells me to say, that's what I'm going to say. So. No, no, it's not a couple million. It's just you and me. We're just having a conversation. No one else is here. It's, yeah. it's just us. It's just us. Yes, sir. You're, you're a junior. Why are you making this decision now as opposed to doing it in your senior year? Yes, sir. I think, you know, with quarterbacks uh, committing early, it allows you to build a class around you. Obviously, you know, uh, the football game is such a team sport that if you don't have an offensive line, receivers, a defense, um, a running back, you know, you're not going to win. So you could have the one person in the world. It's not a, a situation where basketball, we can have a person score 70 and win the game. So I'm a guy that's going to walk in and, you know, help build this class at the school I pick and uh, build it to the number one you know, recruiting class in the country. And then that's we're going to do what it do from there. So. Okay, Jaden, my man, uh, it's announcement time. Where will you be headed for the 2024 season? Yes, sir. Um, so first and foremost, I'd like to give all glory and praise to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, uh, for waking me up another day and allowing me to share this special moment with the world. Through this recruiting process, I've grown to learn more and more about myself as time goes on, and he's been with me every step of the way. I'd like to thank ESPN for allowing me to make my announcement on the great network and utilizing that platform. A special thank you to A.D. Beatty, David Oliver, and Rod Rochelle for organizing this event. As a kid growing up in Duluth, Georgia, I instantly had dreams of this day being my reality. And now it has come. I want to thank every teacher, coach, mentor that has instilled their energy into me. Uh, and I can assure you that none of it goes unappreciated. My God, Coach Boom. Thank you for being with me, to thick and thin, uh, and being a big brother to me. You know, our relationship goes beyond any quarterback drill, and we're forever locked in. Uh, my guys, Coach Matt and Ro, y'all have had my back since day one, and it's forever reciprocated. Um, to my teammates, you know, sitting right there, I love y'all boys, man. And I thank you for welcoming me in, and I'm grateful for each and every one of y'all. Um, I can't wait to step on the field with you guys uh, for one last year and bring home another title to you know, Providence Day School. To all my coaches at PD, thank you for all the sacrifices you've made. To Coach, to Coach Greer, thank you for trusting me with your program and caring more about the person off the field rather than on. A special thanks to Cam Newton for taking me in as your own. You know it is what it is, bro. To my siblings, it has always been my goal to be the best role model for y'all to look up to. And I hope I've done that this far. Lastly, my parents, um, thank you for the countless sacrifices you made for me to get in this position I am today. Pops, thank you for showing me what a true man should resemble. And Ma, thank you for always being there for me and looking at me as more than a football player. And uh, with that being said, it is my great honor to announce that for the next three to four years, I'll be committed to the University of Michigan. <laughs> Jaden Davis going to Michigan. That's beautiful. All right, everybody, you crying, mom crying, everybody crying, Sage Steele in here crying. You made everybody <laughs> cry, Jaden. So why Michigan, bro? 
No, I think uh, Michigan did a great job, you know, recruiting my whole family. You know, obviously, you guys see that you know, I'm a big family person, big on relationships and loyalty. And they've done nothing but show that to me. Uh, me and Coach Harbaugh have a great relationship. Uh, he was recruiting, recruiting me. And I think, uh, you know, it shows dividends when a head coach has a one on one relationship with the recruit, especially a quarterback, because, you know, at, at a college level, that's going to be the two guys that's kind of criticized the most and praised the most. So I um, really appreciate Coach Harbaugh, Coach Campbell, um, Coach Moore, the whole, the whole staff up there, Coach Sinagoga. And the recruiting staff, you know, helping recruit me and my family. Um, you know, shout out to, to Blue Nation and everything about Michigan. So um, I'm loving everything about being a Wolverine, and I can't wait to get up there and earn my job. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.